Hey guys, so I'm finally getting around to doing a video on how to do the colored joggers on rebreathers on any outfits glitch. They're very simple glitches, and I did speed up the time on some parts of the video just to get it down from a 20 minute video to a 7 minute video at the latest, but I can assure you it's all 100%, it's all in real time. As you can see though, I have the purple and pink joggers, however I did want to put the helmet on for the pink joggers. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to jobs and play adversary mode and you're going to do any of the drop zones I chose drop zone 1 like I said though it really does not matter the only thing that changes is where you will spawn in once you're done with the glitch so you're gonna wanna do this with four people shout out to Blood King Kong and my cousin Shane who helped me with this video I'm going to put their channels in the description so make sure you guys like and subscribe and check them out um, so, yeah, you want to do four people. Doing it with randoms can be difficult because they don't always cooperate or they just, they don't always cooperate. And it's such a pain in the butt because, honestly, yeah. So, you're going to want to do four teams. That way you can choose, have the four different colors. So, when you set it up, make sure you do four teams and there really doesn't need to be, like, a time limit or anything. It doesn't really matter. Just kind of leave everything as is if you can. So, when you spawn in, you're going to want to go to the colored team of your choice. I wanted the pink joggers and the pink helmet, so I went to the pink team and let everybody else figure out where they wanted to go. You need at least one person on each team for it to start. So when you, everybody gets on the team they want, just ready up and wait for you to join into the job. I will say now in advance, this is my first time ever doing a commentary and recording commentary for any of my videos, so this is a little bit weird for me, but I am trying my best to make this as normal and not awkward as possible. So kind of just hang in there for me, guys. Um, I will be doing this more often, though, because I really do enjoy this and I like being able to talk to you guys. So when you spawn in, don't really try not to move around so much. It's really not that big of a deal if you do. It's really... And there's no point to it, so you're going to pull up your interaction menu, and you're going to go to Style. Any day now. Sierra, come on. Now, there you go. You're going to go to Style, and you're going to go down to Helmet Visor. And what you're going to do is you're just going to spam that button back and forth, and where it says Visor Down, Visor Up. As you can see, I did mess up a couple times where my fingers went up or my fingers went down. However, that does not matter in the end. As long as you do for at least 20 seconds spamming visor down, visor up, you'll be fine. So after you do that, you're going to put your controller down and just don't touch it. What your goal is, is to lag out. So don't touch it, stay still, don't move. Just put it completely down. So you're going to wait until you are kicked from the session for idling too long and I get excited when I get kicked so I just spam that X button um, I want to say now I did not find this glitch or I did not find this glitch on my own I find it online um, you can find it through any channel I just I had a couple of my viewers ask me to record it so as you can see I was kicked from the session for idling too long it takes about three or four minutes to do three four five minutes it's a longer process, but it's so worth it in the end. Honestly, I love my colored joggers so much. So as you can see, I spawned in wearing the colored joggers and the actually the entire outfit. The only thing that does not save or transfer over is the out or the parachute that you were wearing on the outfit. Which is a total bummer because I personally love that parachute. I think it's so cool and make the outfit look so much better. So you're gonna go to any clothes store or any ammunition and you're gonna save your outfit. And excuse my really crappy driving. So there you have it. You're just going to go into any clothes store and save your outfit. And that's how you get your colored joggers. And it works with any color. You have purple, green, orange, and pink. <laughs> so now I'm going to show you guys how to do the rebreathers glitch. Oh my gosh, guys. This is my favorite glitch. I have a rebreather on every single outfit. And it's the easiest thing to do. So what you're going to do for this is you're going to go to Secure Serve and you're going to register as a CEO. It doesn't matter which order you do this, but you want to make sure that you also have the outfit that you want to put the rebreather on. You want to make sure that you're wearing it. 
So after you register as a CEO, you're going to need at least one other person for this. It could be a random, but it just goes faster if you have a friend. That way they can just join and you can get it started and get it done and over with. So again, I did this with my friend, Blood King Kong, and my cousin. And like I said, make sure you guys check them out and check out their YouTubes. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to challenges and you're going to start salvage. It should be the second challenge, I believe. I'm going to start salvage, and you don't actually have to do it, you just want to actually do the job. So you're going to go, uh, you just want to start the job, excuse me, I'm sorry. So you're just going to fly over there, um, it's definitely going to speed up this really crappy helicopter flying of mine. So when you get over there, it should say that you have equipped the rebreather. If you look on your character though, it is not actually on your character until you jump in the water. So you're just going to dive into the water. I give myself a 5 out of 10 on that dive there. And as you see, the rebreather should spawn onto your character. The rebreather will spawn onto any hat or with any helmet, which is really cool because I know a lot of people like having the bulletproof helmet and the rebreather because one, it just it looks so cool together. So there you have it. And yeah, that's definitely the look I was going for. So after you do this, you're going to want to make sure you do this all within the 10 minutes that you're given. If not, you, um, so sorry. If not, the rebreather will be taken off your outfit. So you're going to want to go to any ammunition. I kind of sped this up a little bit too much, but I was kind of just trying to keep it within the time frame. So you're going to go to any ammunition and you're going to save your outfit. And you, there you have it. You have the rebreather. And this works, like I said, with pretty much any outfit. So there you go. The rebreather. Very easy, very simple. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe for more videos. And I'll catch you guys next time.